What's going on my dream team? Dave back at you with something I don't do a ton of on the channel, but tis the season and that's some baseball. Uh, Bowman baseball to be exact and we got a jumbo box here. Um, so I'm gonna tell you right now this will probably be a longer video. Um, I'm not super knowledgeable about baseball so um, you know feel free to uh, educate me below or at the same time if you see anything you're interested in let me know because most of the stuff I'm probably just gonna sit and, and flip um, but want to do it because it's it's fun and uh, I'd say from an investment standpoint if you can ever consider sports cards investing uh, which I ah, it's more gambling um, the 300 bucks for a jumbo box compared to let's say like a football product for 300 bucks um, you get a lot more boom potential so like your ceiling than football um, especially if you are willing to, to sit on, on some of these prospects for a little while. So with that, we're gonna jump into you know, this guy here. And like I said, feel free to uh, go grab a drink, some food, whatever, kick back. So we'll probably be here for a little while. Uh, we're looking at three autos, uh, just autos, no mem cards. Whoa, got Wander Franco flying everywhere. So man down. It's okay, it's just a paper one. I know he's the guy everybody's trying to chase, but it's still maybe maybe five bucks for the, the paper base. So um, hopefully we can replace that with, with something better then. But <clears throat> for you filler fans, no fillers are gonna be thrown. And actually, look who just showed up. Sunday just woke up from a nap. Uh, but yeah, let's get on, let's get on into this fun stuff. So 32 cards per pack, hoping we can find some, some nice color as well as some nice autos. But really, Bowman's really kind of taken off the last couple of years. Everybody's all about those first Bowman rookie cards, especially the chrome versions, colors, autos, all that fun stuff. All right, so we are gonna have lots of base. of Longoria, Willie Adams, Soto. Um, supposedly, uh, I've been seeing on Instagram and, and whatnot, uh, Bryce Harper in his Phillies uniform uh, is in here. Pretty short print, but pretty hot card right now. Tyler Ward rookie. We'll send all the rookies over here. And probably our first Bowman's over to the left. Newman. Oops, that's a rookie. <laughs> this dude. I think he's a catcher and third baseman. Yeah, there we go. I was looking at this card the other day because I've done a little bit of retail stuff. This dude is huge. He looks like an offensive lineman. Uh, Kopek. Freeland, Rosario, Judge, Wendell, Scherzer. Nice little action shot, chrome card. Richard Lawson, top 100 prospects. Oh, we got a purple auto right away. But I uh, was looking to see if that one was numbered. But it uh, looks like we got Rock Burke, pitcher, purple. Number to 250. Another nice thing about Bowman, all this stuff is on card. Um, however, uh, not the, the ray we wanted, um, but uh, pitchers generally don't, don't sell as well for, for investments. You're really looking for those position players, right? Florial, Wentz, first Bowman, Julio Rodriguez, Put a little gold out of a blaster box of this dude. I've done a couple of blaster box. So beer, first Bowman's. We'll go try to go through these a little bit faster. We're trying to organize a little bit. All right, that was the first pack. Sunday's sitting on the chair next to me now, watching and waiting, seeing what's going on. So I am gonna do, like I said, a little bit of organizing as you can see, probably as we're, we're breaking this, but might have to go back, clean some things up, and uh, review some stuff. Hudson, Jansen, Wright, gonna have a ton of rookies. Carpenter, Franco, Bellinger, I think he's having a pretty good year. Cabrera, future Hall of Famer there. Abreu, Archer, Strom. Uh, you guys, you guys can read. You don't need me to name all of these. Lots of twins rookies in this set. Otani. All right, 
Kyle Lewis, top 100. And then these are uh, these are some pretty cool, pretty cool inserts. The 30th anniversary for for Bowman. There are autograph versions. I think they're sticker though. And we get a Lion Richardson pitcher first Bowman, number two 150. It's always interesting. I'm curious how all these surface grades are going to be given the, the stamping and imprint. You can almost see it's the got the indentation. I'm assuming Beckett and stuff isn't going to take that into account. All right. For our first Bowman. Um, and like I said, if you're interested in any of these Chrome cards, these rookies, um, these, these first Bowmans, let me know. Drop a comment down below. We'll work something out. Um, obviously, if it's just one card that's like a $2 card, um, I'd prefer to move more stuff in a set uh, just to make it worthwhile for shipping. Victor Mesa Jr., I think he's another good chase guy. What people are hunting for. Whoa, it's okay. Marciano. All right, next up. That's Sunday. Oh, my hand was probably in the way. But Sunday's deciding she's going to play with her toys. So you guys might get a show too, other than me trying to act like I know something about baseball. Uh, Lindor, Betts, Albies. That dude. This guy. Some of these rookie cards are starting to look really familiar. Recio first Bowman. Chavis Chrome kind of looks like Pedroia there. Is he a little dude? 5'10. I think Pedroia is a little bit shorter than that. Keller, 100. Ooh, we got a gold paper. Mitch Hinier. Let's just set that over there. That one is numbered 3450. Not a gold chrome, gold paper. Gold paper. Look at your favorites. Brennan Lowe. Wow. Ookie Betts, right? You know? That dude, I've got a bunch of his rookies, or first Bowmans. I think that's like my fourth or fifth one, just from a few blaster boxes. Hernandez. Dato, got a couple of these. Joy Bart's as well, in the Chrome version. All over the place here. Sanchez Castle. Cool. All right. We're about a third of the way in. So this, this probably end up being a 20 minute video. Like I said, feel free to pause at any time. Or if one of the ads pops up, go grab a snack. Whatever you want to do. Uh, sometimes things like this are probably, oops, probably better uh, when you're doing something else in the background just to wait and see or listen. If there's anything amazing. Jake Bowers, I pulled an auto out of his, out of Gypsy Queen, out of uh, our retail pack actually. Every once in a while I'll just go buy some baseball just for something to rip, some cheap $10 packs. Graham Marte, we'll call it Stanton, JD Martinez, Lux, Corey Ray, oops. All right, Casey Mize. I'll double check some of these inserts and stuff later, make sure none of them are, are numbered on the back. Talent pipeline. I'll probably have to also go through my stack of base, make sure I didn't miss any rookies or, or first Bowmans. Brayu, Martinez. All right, Swaggerty. Lots and lots of young guys. I know some of these guys have also been in the Bowman product for years and years and years. Just haven't made it to the majors. Um, Bowman really is focused on younger guys. And not a ton of, of vets. Mirrors, Muto, Chapman. And that's also why you see so many rookie cards and first Bowmans. Justice Sheffield. Mullins, tons and tons of rookies. You know, I'd say uh, Jumbo Box is really good if you're a, a set builder and looking to build a set. It looks like we got some cool red shimmer action coming up here. And it is a another pitcher. 
Casey Mice. That's a really nice on card. I know he's got a really clean signature. And what is that number two? Not numbered. All right, just looks like a red shimmer refractor. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. No, I didn't see that. It's glossed in the shimmer. Five of five. Wow. Super short print. Um, not a rookie, not a first Bowman, unfortunately. Um, but a, uh, a young pitcher here. And I did cut the, the sides of those sleeves to not damage any of these corners, but all right, let's see a little bit about this dude. First round pick, first overall. All right, I guess this dude's pretty good. Um, cool. Uh, if you guys know anything about this guy, drop a comment down below. Um, I'll have to look that up later and see if, uh, if that's uh, the card worth having or if it's better just to, to flip it rather than sit on it. I know some of this Bowman stuff, it's actually better to sit on it for a few years or just put it away in a gun safe, safety deposit box, don't look at it kind of thing. All right. Oh, nope. Oh, Sunday's making her first appearance on the table. My dad and I were just talking about this last time I was home uh, a couple weeks ago of uh, just waiting for this to happen and she's uh, made her, her first little appearance there. All right, Sunday. Everybody's here to see you anyways. You gonna say anything? No, you're just gonna sit there? All right, that's okay. That's why we didn't put a, that Mize up there. She was sitting on the, uh, sitting on the chair watching. So as long as she stays there, we should be good. What are you doing? You opening baseball cards with daddy? Yeah, all right. Grinky. Now I gotta watch her out of the corner of my eye too. Make sure nothing, uh, nothing crazy happens, that she doesn't come this way. Tons of rookies. Trout, Scooter, Chrome, Jimenez, Rip the show, and hey, that's a nice looking card, to 125. Cabrera. Marlon's got a ton of prospects in this. 28 of 125. First Bowman. Another pitcher. This has been a pitcher box, unfortunately. Because that's not what we're what we're looking for. We want those position players. Puck. But still better than uh, than nothing. Eloy, Chrome. Um, I got a little stack of him. I'm gonna set that aside, sleeve it up later. Eloy is, I think he got called up early in the season. He's been doing been doing pretty decent from what it seems. But he was, uh, I think his first Bowman was, was last year. It was one of the, the chase cards from 2018 product, I believe. I'm getting my years correct. From the limited knowledge of baseball I have. Kern, Ballard, Lugo, Bowers, Osmer. Wow. Just tons and tons of rookies. Nolan Gorman. We're going to your favorites, Christian Stewart. And he's one of the cool Sterling inserts. I don't know what the, uh, the odds of these are, if these are one, or one per box or not, but the Bowman Sterling did it. I think it boasts. <laughs> Uh, all right, she got bored. Baseball and uh, and football did some Bowman Sterling, but cool product. All right, set that back up. Now that Godzilla Kitty is is done. And I think those Sterlings do come in an autograph version from some of the the research I've done. Bichette, Dante Bichette's son, and his uh, his brother played on the, the St. Paul Saints. I don't know if he signed in the, in the majors yet, but he's had a, a cup of coffee. Whoop. Dropping some paper cards. Uh, 
And this will probably be the, be my guess, probably the only jumbo box they do. Hey, we got a Vlad on the back. So actually, just take that aside. I know it's not a rookie, just a base, but his stuff is so hot. It doesn't matter if it's base or not. Um, everybody's chasing Vlad stuff. Yeah, like I said, this will probably be the only, same thing as the Yelich. Yelich is starting off really well. Any Yelich base I'm pulling and just setting aside. And once I get like 10 cards, I'll probably just sell a lot on eBay or something. Um, maybe maybe I'll do a hobby box in the future or, or something like that. Or if that Mize card is any good, um, flip it. Maybe get another jumbo box just for, for fun. Some cool content to open. Something different. I know a lot of guys come to the channel for football, but there are some baseball guys out there. Whoa, focus was off. All right, Sinzel, or Whitley. We got one of the atomic refractors. Hey, you have a Shohei. It's not a bad little insert to pull. All right, where did I make the, there we go. Shohei's stuff is still, even second year stuff, is still selling pretty well, so it's not a bad little card. It's probably 20, 30 bucks, maybe. And we've got a Ryan Weathers to 250. So getting a decent amount of color. That's a paper one. Alex Baum, Sterling. So I guess that answers it's not one per box or anything. A heart, Bart, sorry. And baseball is one of those things where I've collected a bunch when I was little. Not a ton as I've gotten older. I mean, because I don't have time to, to watch all the games, keep up on all the prospects. And there's so many guys. That and you got to have patience, um, especially with, with the Bowman and the prospects and, and everything. You may, take, you may pull a card and then five years later it's worth crazy money versus right now. Whereas generally with football, you know within their first three years if the dude's a stud or not. I'll just refactor that. So a little bit of gold. Grinky, Suarez, Anderson, Chris Davis. All right, coming up on that 20 minute mark, we'll try to blow through this here a little bit faster. Garcia, Wilson, Stewart, Telez, another trout. I feel like we just had that same pattern of cards here not too long ago. A few packs ago. Ruiz, that dude, number 51. Kobe Allard, Let's see Bowman 30th, Nick Madrigal, and all these inserts between that and what I've pulled from some of the, the retail stuff I've done, I'll probably just try to sell them all. Set. Carter Kaboom, he's uh, going to be the future of, of Washington, especially now that, that Harper's gone. Him and Soto are going to be pretty solid, I believe. I pulled uh, an auto of his to 25 when I bought a Bowman Chrome HTA box last year. Actually, did that when I was out here in California scoping out um, the, the job for the first time. And so pulled all that off, off camera. So uh, it's uh, interesting. I'll have, I think I'll always have a little connection to Carter Kaboom. Uh, ended up selling that card for I think like 500 bucks or something crazy like that. And that kind of really opened my eyes to what Bowman baseball is. And I'm sure five years from now, I'm gonna be watching this video going, man, that, uh, that Kaboom I pulled way back in the day, shouldn't have sold it. Hopefully he's not the next Trout or anything like that. Acuna, second year. Neil, Duggar, Shaw, Kyle Tucker. This dude, I saw his garden retail pack. He just looks like a, he doesn't look super athletic, but I think he's got some pretty good stats. Yeah, he had 24 homers last year. Pretty decent average. Fifth overall pick. That's the thing about baseball, right? Like, you don't need to look like a, a built, jacked football player, a linebacker, or anything to be good. A lot of it's all about technique, repetition, practice. There's another kaboom. Do have one more auto coming up. Brennan McKay. We'll, uh, it's gonna be one of these last two packs here. Downs. Yeah, because we only pulled two. 
Julio Rodriguez for Spoman on the Chrome version. And these paper ones probably really ain't going to be great for much other than packaging filler or just selling as a big giant lot. I think everybody really likes the colors and the chrome. All right, let's see if this one's got an auto in it. Hopefully our last auto can be, be nice to have a, a color parallel of a position player since we've got so many pitchers going. And really with pitchers, right, it's just guys just don't stay healthy for as long as position players do. I mean, look at Kershaw. He's just dominant early on in his career and it's been starting to wear down. He's had a lot of injuries the last couple of years. Low. He's Victor, Victor, Victor Mesa, first Bowman. Lee. And then ready for the show, Mount Castle. Talent Pipelines. Looks like our uh, last side is going to be in our last pack. Right. Kenna, Smith, Cruz, William Contreras, Amaya, Luis Robert, Paez, and De La Cruz. All right, here we go. Last pack mojo. Um, I would expect it, given we've got two color autos, for this just to be a, one of the base autos, refractor autos. Maybe we'll get a redemption or something. Um, but I don't expect anything crazy to come out of this last pack, just given what we're at so far. Kyle Wright, Givens, Carpenter, Franco, Bellinger, Cabrera, Abreu, Archer. Gilmore, Cave, Tani again. No Harpers. All right, Bo Burrows. Your downs. And oh, did we miss out on Otto? Yeah, I only saw the two, right? Ready for the show. You're a, ah, there we go. It's hiding behind that one. Like I said, just the uh, the base. But it was a position player. Hey, and another Wanda behind that. And it is a first Bowman. Uh, Brewer Hicklin. Let's check him out. Seventh round pick. Decent stats. And there's a Wander. Let's sit there. Another McKay. We got a nice little run of first Bowmans here. All right. Well, there you go, my friends. That will do it. As always, thanks for checking out the channel, supporting it, and also supporting something a little bit different. Like I said, it's not football, it's baseball, um, but it is that time of year. So, as always, thanks for checking out the channel. Like, subscribe, tell a friend, and we will catch you next time. See ya.